At InFocus Energy Services, we design drilling and completion tools for the oil and gas industry. SolarWorks Simulation helps us do that by taking our CAD models, applying loads to them, see how they'll behave, and, and make sure the tools we're putting out the door are the best tools we can. As part of the design of our reflex drilling motor, we had to come up with a drive system to transmit about 30,000 foot-pounds of torque through an articulating drive. Traditionally, that would be done with the system using ball bearings. We actually moved into using these custom-designed articulating drive pins. We can get an, a larger effective radius and a larger effective contact patch out of this design than we can out of this while still maintaining the articulation. We needed to simulate the entire system under torque, and that's where Simulia Structural Simulation Engineer, or SSE, comes in. Simulia SSE lets us pull in our SolidWorks data very quickly. It's a one-click export out of SolidWorks into SSE. Then we can start setting up the problem. The general contact algorithm that SSE uses allows us to run very large amounts of contact with high amounts of nonlinearity and sliding, friction, things like that, and still solve in a reasonable time. And rather than solving it locally on my machine, I can push that off to the cloud and use high-performance computing resources to solve that. It took our contact setup from hours to minutes. This is the drive shaft for our 7-inch reflex motor. And what we're interested in simulating is the bearings inside the drive system. In SolidWorks, we only had one of these drive pins simulated. In SSE, we were able to take all of them, the entire system with the inner drive shaft and the outer drive shaft adapter, and run them much quicker. We were able to get really, really tight meshing where we need it, as well as much coarser meshing when we don't. Near the contact zone, we have very, very thin elements, and then they get larger with a bias as we move away from the contact zone. That type of mesh control is what let us do some really, really good analysis in SSE in a relatively quick time frame.